So for our career presentation, we're gonna be presenting them using Flipgrid. So in Google Classroom, you're going to go under classwork. You're gonna find the career exploration section and you should be able to find presentation uh, recording Flipgrid or something to that nature. There's a link for you to click. It'll take you to the class link. You're gonna click it and you're gonna join with Google. You can sign in with your K-12 information through Google and get signed in. We're gonna record a response once we get here. You might see other students' videos down below. You don't need to watch them because we're gonna end up watching them during class. So no need to watch them twice. But if you are absent from class the day we present, you may need to come here and watch them. So for today, right now, you're going to record a response. Within this section, we're going to click the options button right next to your red record button. And we're going to go record screen. And it's going to give us a few options. So we're going to hit start recording and you can choose your entire window or entire screen. You can choose just a window or a tab. We're going to choose the entire screen for this because it's going to include our video picture. For this assignment, you need to have your video recording in the bottom or some portion on your page. All right. So the presentation is not only your video or your slideshow, but it's also you giving the presentation. Before I click share, we're going to make sure our Google uh, slides are set up right. Now, when it typically, when you go to the present button on Google Slides, it's going to put you in full screen right away. And so if you want to get out of here, um, you only have full screen or you have all this other stuff, all your, your tabs on the side or your different uh, thumbnails. So one way to turn that off on a Mac, you can hit Command Shift F. On a PC, it's Control Shift F. Again, Control Shift F or Command Shift F. So once I'm in Google Classroom and I hit present, I'm on a Mac, so I'm gonna hit Command Shift F all at the same time. And it's now still letting me be in presentation mode without being full screen. So my video continues to be down here at the bottom. That's what we want it to look like. Now you can come back here to Flipgrid now that we have it set up and we have our entire screen selected and we're gonna hit share. And it's gonna give you a countdown till it starts recording. And then we're going to make sure we're clicked on our presentation and you can work through your different slides. Give your presentation. And go through all the different parts of your presentation that need to be included. When you're all done, what you can do is you can click back to the Flipgrid tab and hit stop recording. Okay, as soon as it stops recording, it's going to take you to the edit page. You can trim, edit, and do more. So we can trim this. Maybe you took a little bit longer to get to your presentation and you saw that countdown screen. We can trim that either side there to make sure that we're getting just the things we want. Another uh, key information here, key piece is please only have tabs open that you need for the presentation. So Google Classroom, Flipgrid, and your hand tool, we shouldn't see all kinds of different uh, tabs up here. Now, one way you can do that is you could open a new window in Chrome. And that way, when you have your presentation open, we just have the few things that you need. That way, nothing embarrassing uh, shows up under your different tab names. And same with your background. When I'm not in full screen, you can see some of my desktop here. That's fine. Just make sure there's nothing embarrassing opened there that you wouldn't want somebody to see out on the World Wide Web, okay? So make sure that you have your screen details cleaned up so there's nothing embarrassing showing up for, for something, uh, you know, files you have saved or pictures on your desktop, things like that. When you're done editing your video and trimming it up, you can then go to next and it's gonna give you some options for publishing your video. You can go back and edit more you can put your first and last initial. We don't need your last name on there. And we want your title. So the title of your presentation, if you pick bricklayer, then you would put bricklayer or mason or you know whatever your topic was should be the title that you put in there. You can also choose your select frame uh, for what everybody sees for your thumbnail when they first sign in. All right, when you're done, you're gonna hit submit and it should, start uploading. 
Now, when we're in Google um, Slides, you may want this to go back to full screen. So if you want this back in full screen, again, remember, you're just going to do reverse. On a PC, it's Control Shift F. On a Mac, it's Command Shift F all at the same time. We'll bring you back to full screen. That way, next time you're doing a presentation and it needs to be full screen, it's in its right, uh, right, right frame there. So when we're all done, we're in the Flipgrid tab. It tells us it was excess. We're going to hit complete. And it might take a little bit to render and show up here, but there should be uh, maybe a video that shows up here for uh, you to see in the future. Okay, Or maybe you don't see it because they're hidden, and that's fine as well. You don't need to watch any videos at this time. We're only doing your recording at this time. Good luck on your presentation. And you do have a full 10 minutes of record time uh, to get your five-minute presentation done.